Here we are at the Career Connection Dinner, where alumni are going to be mentoring students on how to get a job after graduation. The purpose of the dinner is to bring together students, alums, and faculty uh, so that they can mingle and talk about their career paths, the benefits of a major. And so for these students who are going to be mostly undeclared and undecided, um, so they can explore what majors are out there and ask questions of faculty members who have been in that field for a long time and to ask alums about what was their experience in that major so that they can better decide what they want to do. Yeah, and I got a, an invitation through um, the mail and they asked me to become, you know, come to this dinner tonight. And I was, you know, it's a real honor because it's, uh, it really helps me try to decide my major. One of the major key takeaways for me is that it's okay to be undecided, that it's, you know, it's not the end of the world, that they're not alone. Um, you know, I hope that they see the other undeclared students in the room and they think that it's a good thing that I'm here because I can have conversations and other people are feeling the same thing that I'm feeling, which is probably a little bit of distress. Um, and then also finding a way to deal with that distress by talking with the alums and talking to them about what do they do, what do they choose, and how are they happy after making those choices. Alumni can offer suggestions to current students about career paths, about maybe activities to become involved with, um, internships, part-time work experiences, um, and maybe how better to focus and, and make some good decisions while they're still students. Um, my advice is to get experience while you're an undergrad. Um, and I would say just by doing a variety of different internships, even if you're an education major or a business major or a communications major, I encourage you to pursue internships in a variety of different fields. And going to our career and co-op office, um, a lot of people actually don't know about it, and this is not just on Cabrini College's campus. I find it that um, when I meet a lot of people, they didn't properly utilize the uh, career and co-op office uh, as best as possible. So I think that's the place, the best place to start. I hope the students realize that they can achieve anything that they put their minds to, um, that they're going to face times where they're going to be undecided and they're not going to be sure if it's the right major or right career path. Um, and it's going to be the same way when they graduate. You're going to be five years out and say, I don't even think I like what I do. Um, but you can change those things and it's all about the experiences that you go through. And if you're willing to put the time and effort into something, um, you can do whatever you put your mind to.